One of the world's longest serving leaders, Chavez was always colourful and deeply controversial. And at the UN, he made sure he always stole the limelight. And it happened one last time when the UN Secretary General was giving a news conference about the Congo. He knew nothing about the Venezuelan leader's death until reporters asked him about it. This is the first time that uh, I hear from you that uh, he has passed away. Uh, as a president of Venezuela, uh, he has been making his own contributions to uh, uh, his own country's uh, development. Uh, at the same time, uh, as a Secretary General, uh, while I will be able to issue a more formal uh, statement, I'd like to uh, convey my deepest condolence to the families and people and government of uh, Venezuela on the loss of uh, President uh, Chavez on that. Uh, you, will, you will have a further uh, statement from me. Russia is one of Venezuela's most important trading partners, the country's ambassador to the UN, the current president of the Security Council, gave this reaction. Well, you know, I think uh, it's, it's a tragedy. He was, uh, I think, a great politician for his country, for Latin America and for the world. And of course, uh, he played a very important role in the development of relations between Venezuela and Russia. So we feel very badly about it. One of Chavez's friends was in tears the Bolivian president, Evo Morales, one of a new generation of leftist politicians in Latin America who saw Chávez as a comrade and a mentor. Chávez will continue to inspire the people fighting for their liberation. He'll always be present throughout the world, through all social sectors. Hugo Chávez will always be with us. After many years of being subjugated, dominated, and in particular the looting of our resources, these moments are very difficult. We share in the loss of Hugo Chavez Frias. His foes, meanwhile, made no secret of their distaste for Chavez. This the reaction from some on the streets of Miami. It's the end of the dictatorship, camouflage as a democracy. So for now we're going to keep the democracy and uh, we'll see what's going on next in the next 30 days. The family's very swollen and we're so happy that he's like gone. We're not celebrating the death of a president or from Hugo Chavez, we're celebrating the renovation of a new democracy, a new era. Chavez was a polarizing figure. Friends and foe will disagree on his influence and on his legacy. But there's no doubt this is a world leader who will never be forgotten. James Bayes, Al Jazeera, and the United Nations.